Okay, so you're tired of scrolling through hours of horrible corporate royalty-free music, and when you finally find a song, it usually gets claimed. So I've been doing this for years on my YouTube channel. Check it out. It's it takes ages. It's really it's really painful. One thing I recommend you try first is to find classical public domain music because it's free and it's classical and it's incredible, powerful, amazing, moving pieces of music that work really well in cinematography with cinematography. You could also buy a subscription, but if you're like me and you ch you're cheap and you don't have any money, you should try making your own music. And I'm going to show you how best to do that for free using GarageBand. Although it would be great if you could play an instrument like guitar or piano, I recommend those because they're amazing, they sound beautiful, pretty easy to pick up and mess around with for short songs. If you can't, no worries, you can always use places like Looperman to find guitar loops or just create a song on your own on GarageBand. Usually, since I can't play guitar, I will have a guitar bass because I like kind of the homemade and charming feel that it adds and it usually just sounds nice like in this song for here the Mura in this song. But for this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I made a song for a dramatic film essay that I'm gonna post soon, and how I made it using entirely GarageBand, no additional instruments, which applies to most of you guys at home, I'm assuming. So first, I'll be adding a little bit of piano. In the organ. So here's the final mix, I hope you like it. It's gonna be for a film essay about conversation, which is why I played around and tried panning the audio from left to right, like a conversation. I mean, it's pretty simple, but I think it works and it's a whole lot better than royalty-free music in my opinion, and you get to control the mood you want more. But if this sounds familiar, it's because it is. My biggest tip, I sound like an infomercial. My biggest tip for you guys, since music is music making is very difficult for beginners in my opinion, I think it's 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 a hard thing. But it's fun when you when you play around and stuff. But if it's difficult for you, just think about a soundtrack you really like, think about a song you really like, kinda of base it off that as a starting point. That's what I did for this song. I kinda of base it off of this piano part from this lovely film essay. Um, called In the Darkness of Time. It's a beautiful essay, watch it right now. That was the starting point because it's so much easier to make music if you go out from a starting point. Another little tip, if you're making music for a horror film, all you gotta do is smash the keys and it will end up perfect. It's perfect. Make it, the more out of tune it is, the better. It sounds just perfect. To summarize, all you really need to be making music is a computer. It's better if you have instruments too, but all you need is a computer or a phone. And remember, simplicity is key. It does so much. 
and I recommend, you know, playing around with the tools, trying to create some cool effects with the effects since GarageBand has an amazing set of tools, better than anything you can find off of corporate royalty free music, I'm telling you that. Try to create some dissonance in the music, that's what I like, it feels very cinematic and stuff. And Google what chords fit with the mood you're trying to portray. But yeah, you can always start with like a melody or chords or a bass line and then kind of build from there, expand, Google what notes fit in that key that you're playing in or Google what key you're even in, make it as long as you want and you're done, that's it. That's how easy it is to make music for your film. All you gotta do is play around and have some fun. But anyways guys, thank you for watching and goodbye.